Hello everyone and welcome to my channel and to what seems to be the first video with a voiceover. Hope you enjoy the content and please consider subscribing. In this video I will continue to do the rigging on the cannons. It's important to note that because of the scale of the model and the scale of the blocks there's not enough space to properly seize the blocks or to use the hooks. So the blocks are tied to the eyeballs with a knot and not properly seized. I start by dipping the blocks in dark oak stain to get them looking older. With the drill I make sure that the holes in the blocks are wide enough. Then I put the block in a little nail that I cut the head of the nail off. And now I put the rope around the block. Now for the island and a knot to secure it and a lip of the top of it. And I like to use a nail clipper to cut the excess of the rope. slightly different process on the single blocks because the rope that will go through the blocks, this one and the double one, needs to come out of this one. So I am making a knot on it, preparing that rope that will go through the blocks to attach the rope to the one that goes around the block. This is the rope that goes around the block. secure the first row around the middle of the second row now the rope goes around the block and it's secured with a little drop of sea glue Now the eye bolt. Finish the knot. And a drop of sea glue again. Threading the rope through the blocks.
matching each set of blocks to the carrying carriage. I'm now drilling the holes for the eye bolts in the bulwark. I probably should have used a template, but I'm a bit lazy to make templates, so I'm doing them by eye. Gluing the cannons in place. And gluing the eye bolts in place.
with the help of a toothpick I apply a bit of CA glue on the rope that comes out of the block around the position where I will later on put the coils. The coils are usually done in a spiral, not the way I'm doing them here, but this way matches better the unkept look that the old ship has, so that's why I'm not doing the spiral, I'm doing a different coil. And with the coils in place, this is the final look at this stage of the assembly. I hope you enjoyed the content. Leave a like, consider subscribing. See you next one.